Yeah, I think this is the type of film that sticks with you for a number of days after you watch it as a audience goer. Um, you know, the final cut and the final version did with me as I grabbed a bucket of popcorn and just enjoyed what was in front of me. And I found myself thinking about, okay, what are ways in my life that I can exhibit kindness that I had never thought about before? Because here are these people that were stuck in this extraordinary situation, and they did the unthinkable by being kind to the other person to the point of sacrificing their life. And it's like, it was so inspiring, so inspiring, the whole thing is. So for me, it was just, uh, like Andy said, you know, we, as Kingdom Story Company, we uh, endeavor to do stories about a rush of hope, and this one is that in spades, yeah. yeah. I mean, I remember when, when I first saw the, the original movie, Wonder, and it was all about kindness. And uh, we had just started our relationship with Lionsgate and they had become our distribution partner. And we're just like, if we could ever be a part of a movie like that, that would be amazing. So Whitebird comes along and it takes that idea of kindness and it adds the element of courage to it in this one. So there's a line in the movie that's in the trailer that gets me every time where, you know, where this grandmother's trying to impart to, to her grandson this, you know, importance of, of that idea. And she said, when an act of kindness could cost you your life, uh, it becomes uh, somewhat of a miracle. So it's that idea of courage. I think we need courage in the world right now to do the right thing and to be kind to people and to stick up for the underdog. You know, the themes of it are so prevalent today. Uh, you know, in a very divisive world, I would say, uh, kindness is so needed right now. And to kind of let go of your circumstances and to be able to treat um, your fellow neighbor, uh, the person standing right next to you with the utmost of selfless kindness and self-sacrifice, just a beautiful story. It's a beautiful message to be able to get that out there right now. Yeah. And I, I, I think on top of that, like, the whole movie is this, uh, you know, beautiful dialogue between generations uh, of an older woman trying to help her teenage grandson understand that, you know, that idea of kindness is timeless and uh, helps by letting him enter into her story. And it feels very modern, even though we're back in time. So there's something so beautiful and whimsical. And that's really a tribute to, to Mark Forrester. Like, he's a master storyteller. So that's why stories like this are things we're proud to be associated with at Kingdom.